Uh, we have uh, Representative Blake Farenthold of Texas joining us right now. Congressman, uh, tell us where you were when you, I don't know if you heard the gunshots or what was going on, but walk us through your personal account of what happened. Well, I'd just gotten back to my office after our weekly Texas Republican delegation lunch, and all of the enunciators, the emergency announcements, were started. And my immediate concern is, where's my staff and where's my daughter? My daughter was having lunch with uh, my communications director, uh, Megan Cronin, and we'd send an intern to go get a vacuum cleaner because there are no janitorial services during the uh, government shutdown. So I was immediately worried about where the rest of the staff was. Uh, just about then, my... Uh, uh, daughter and Megan came bursting in the door. They were the second to last people that got let into the Cannon building before the lockdown and they ran and came in and then about 30 seconds later somebody pounded on the door and it was our intern with a vacuum cleaner and we let him in. So my, my immediate concern was for the safety of my staff. We all got on the phone and uh, I called my mother and uh, my wife and the staff all called their families as well. We tweeted everybody was safe but it was certainly a a, a, a kind of scary day. Uh, that's what we've been hearing from many of your colleagues. It's pretty frightening.